says we did it again. It's been a while, but welcome to another episode of We Are The Wick. Today the Hackney Wick fans are out in great numbers as we take on Clapton CFC for the first time in the league. Um, we've got Gio and Max who are back in the squad. Uh, and let's see how the boys will do. They're going into change rooms now. Uh, Hackney are on the back of a five match unbeaten run, uh, drawn 2-1-3. And are really trying to push for three title contenders, but let's see how they get on. Plan, apply the game plan. First 10 minutes is key. Don't go out there and sleep and fall asleep in blocks of the games, throw ons and all of that. And you know when they stop playing, every team is going to try and do it, so it's just going to go along. Deal with that, yeah? Let's make sure we're totally, you know the key thing, psychological, make sure you're focused. Focus on the match. Talk your way through the game. First 10 minutes, build it up, next 10 minutes, build it up, next 10 minutes, build it up, and build ourselves into the game, yeah? Do you understand? We should have no problem with confidence right now. Yeah, we have to carry, to carry on this run. I don't care, we have to carry on. We're coming off that pitch with the three points, regardless, but we have to build the game through. Remember what I said? Build it. Does everyone get it? Are we ready? Yeah. Yeah? Are we ready? Yes! Right, let's get ready, yeah? You've got two minutes, three minutes before we get out, okay? Keep talking now, start talking from now, yeah? The banter has started early with the Clapton CFC fans taunting the Hackney with FC fans saying there's no team in Hackney. And there they are, the best fans in the league. You'll never outsing them, that's for sure. And as we await our new kits, uh, the team are wearing the Vets kits today, also the women's team's um, kit. Let's see how they get on in these colours. It's been an edgy start, uh, both teams vying for the ball. Clapton probably had the better chances already so far, but they're yet to penetrate. Another shot here just goes wide here. Hackney been, been in good form of late, beating uh, title favourites uh, Cannons Woods 3-2 in the last game. The game before that also uh, beating, no, the last game before that drawing actually with Brims down. Um, and before that beating Hutton and, uh, I want to say Wolfram Abbey, but it's not Wolfram Abbey. Um, it was Tower Hamlets and also a draw against Basildon. So this is a five match unbeaten run. Um, so they should be feeling very confident here. We've got our new VO camera now. Hopefully uh, there will be no goals missed, no chances missed as we have issues in the past with uh, missing some of our uh, footage. And claps on the ball here. Oh, he's played it through. Is that not offside? No. And he smashes it into the roof for the net. That's 1-0. It looked offside there. It looked offside. Let's take a look at it again. No, he was onside. Um, his marker didn't track him there. And it's 1-0 to Clapton. And yeah, uh, Clapton had the lead there. We go again now with the ball. This guy's been a fawn in the Hackney Wick of C's side all day. He puts it through. Keepers come out. Oh, ref's giving a penalty. Fred's come out there taking his man out, it looks like. And the referee has given a penalty. A chance now for Clapton to double their lead here. Can Fred make amends? Step up. 2-0 Clapton. And there is at half time, Hackney are down 2-0. It's a tough task, but can Hackney turn it around at half time? Going down 2 0 unexpectedly against uh, Clapton at home. Hackney were full of confidence before the game, so let's see what they can do in the second half. Yeah. 
are you? Why are you doing your thing? Why are you going off? Talk to me. Yeah? Why are you going off? Huh? Have you told me to fuck it over there? Did I fucking tell you to over there? Did I tell you that? So why are you doing it? What annoys me here is that you lot do your own thing. That's what pisses me off. Clear the ball with your left foot as well. Two, three, four, you've gone in and made a tackle that way and you're still trying to use your right foot. Shows a lack of focus. You're making it, I told you, the only way we're going to lose is through mistakes. That's the only way. We're going to lose from mistakes. You see you two, where are you, you and you, yeah? You and you, this is what pisses me off about you. You get the ball and you slow down. Then two men come. And then three men come. Why do you two do that? That's why we're not creating anything. You're coming inside. Why are you coming inside? Why? Has it, has it worked? So why are you doing it? You're coming inside, playing that narrow, yeah? And when we haven't taken him out wide once, you're just running into day job. You know what? It's all about you. It's a team game. Get out of there and then get into the boxes I told you to. And the second half has now started. Can Hatton, you can see, get themselves back into the game. I mean, it's only 2 0. One goal can make a difference here. The ball's picked up here. It's with Edwin now. He drives forwards, looks for the pass, plays it in. Hackney here on the attack. It's come through, and that looks like a handball. It looks like a handball, yes. Referee's giving a handball, a chance now for Hackney with FC to get themselves back in the game. Uh, Frankie's the usual penalty taker. But Solly's picked up the ball here. There's a bit of handbags going on between Solly and Frankie about who's going to take the uh, penalty. Frankie doesn't, uh, Solly doesn't want to give the ball away. This is a bit embarrassing here. Solly's walking away with the ball, doesn't want to give it back to Frankie. What's going on here? And they're still arguing. A bit of a push there. Uh, by uh, Frankie what's actually going on he goes back over and he picks up the ball and Solly walks away from it and it appears Frankie finally pulls rank goes to take the Oh, off the crossbar and it goes over the bar. Oh, that was a chance for Hatton you can see to get back into the game. And Solomon's being substituted straight away because of his antics and behaviour. Oh. And it remains 2 0. We're only a few minutes to go now. Clapton have a free kick in the Hackney half. I mean, I think they deserved it, and Hackney have tried and battled this second half, but they just couldn't get um, any clear cut chance apart from the, I guess, the uh, penalty. And the Fools here. And they've scored again a third goal into the bottom corner, and that's it 3 0 to Clapton. Even a surprise, maybe sometimes you need a little thing. I see Gio working hard, and I'm like, okay. Cool, yeah, I'm upset with the result, but nah. First thing comes first, yeah, is that we're a family, yeah? And if someone disrespects that, nah. So I'm not have to say, I can't even grill you for the second half, I can't. Yes, I'm upset with the first half, that'll be addressed at training, through training. But I have nothing to say about the second half, because I know Frankie, on a normal day, puts that penalty away. What this guy has done for us, this season, has been quite phenomenal, to be honest with you. 
You get it? Yes. And, and there's so many times when he's given people penalties. That boy had penalties. Free kick, he scored two free kicks. But I told him on Wednesday, get off the free kick. Go stand there, I want him on the left, I want you to sit. And he did it with no qualms. So what he did was selfish. I'm not going to get into your second half performance. What I'm saying is that there's no way we're going to go the whole of the season not losing the game again. It is what it is. We move on. Yeah. Next set of games are important. Because so they're above us if they stretch up. But they will lose games. They went seven games on beat, um, losing. And now they've won two in a row. We went four games with, with a draw and like three defeats. Yeah. And then we went on a um, five game, four game unbeaten run. Do you understand? It is what it is. I have no qualms in the second half. Because everyone put everything 